The second trailer for Avengers Endgame arrived without warning in the early hours of Thursday morning, surprising fans everywhere with some brand new footage from the highly anticipated film. Of course, just like the first two teasers for Endgame, this trailer came with a multitude of questions and very few answers. The deeper you look, the more hints rise to the surface. Some of these arrived in the form of callbacks to previous Marvel films, while others tease of what's yet to come. Regardless, there is a lot of information in this trailer, and we're about to break down each of the big moments and burning secrets. Let's take a deep dive into Avengers Endgame trailer and see what kind of tragic gems are buried within. The trailer starts with Tony talking to Pepper, just as the first trailer did. This time it's a little different though, as he ends his speech with mentioning of having one last surprise up his sleeve. This could easily be written off as Tony referencing his exit to space at the beginning of Infinity War, thinking he could do the impossible and save the world one last time. However, there is some thought that perhaps Tony had something else in mind. Whether it be a personal surprise for Pepper or a big idea to try and make the entire galaxy safe again, Tony has a plan in place. While most of the voiceovers in Endgame trailer was provided by the Avengers themselves, the footage of Captain America's past was narrated by the love of his life, the late Peggy Carter. The lines spoken by Peggy here aren't new, but they certainly do set the stage for the events of the final Avengers film. Think back to Captain America Winter Soldier when Steve is talking to Peggy in the hospital. That's where the dialogue comes from. The world has changed and none of us can go back. All we can do is our best, and sometimes the best is all we can do, is to start over. Of course, Steve and the others aren't exactly heeding this advice, because it seems like going back in time and fixing the past is exactly what they're going to try and do. An interesting shot of Hawkeye before the snap gives us a tease of his potential replacement, Kate Bishop. Clint Barton is seen helping a young girl learn how to shoot a bow and arrow. This could be his daughter, but the girl seems a little bit older than his daughter would have been, and if this isn't his daughter, it's most likely Kate. In the comics, Kate Bishop takes over as the mantle as Hawkeye as Clint gets older. Could Endgame be setting up the same story so that the heroic archer can continue on in the MCU? As we saw in the first Endgame trailer, Clint Barton is likely taking on a new mantle at some point in the movie. After probably losing his entire family to the snap, Clint will go a little off the rails, donning a hood and adopting the name Ronan. One way to signal this big transformation is for Clint's new hairstyle. He's got a Ronan undercut, rather than his classic fun-loving dad haircut that we've all become used to. Odds are this is a very different Clint Barton than we saw in Civil War. When the snap occurred in Avengers Infinity War, Scott Lang was stuck inside the Quantum Realm due to the sudden dusting of the entire Van Dyne family. The first shot of him in this new trailer shows what happened when he first made his way back to the real world. There's no telling exactly how he gets out, but it's seen walking around in a deserted street trying to make sense of what's been happening in the world. All of a sudden, everyone Scott loves is gone, and he has no idea where or why. Something will have to click with Scott before he makes his way back to Avengers Headquarters, but he first has to come back from San Francisco, and he's got a long road ahead of him. Natasha's narration delivers a line about halfway through the trailer, teasing that the Avengers have some sort of plan as to how they're going to fix what Thanos destroyed. By the way it sounds, they all know that there's a very good chance that the plan won't work, but they also understand that there's no one else in the world that's going to bring it back to the way it was. Oh well, whatever it takes. There are several shots in the trailer showing off a fight that the Avengers are involved in, but it looks like a battle that is much closer to home than those that took place in Infinity War. Avengers Headquarters is under attack. A leaked look at an Avengers Lego set teased that Thanos would attack the Avengers compound in New York, so we have already had our eyes peeled for that, but things become even clearer during the trailer, specifically in a shot where Ant-Man is standing alone in one of the offices. If you look very closely, you can see explosions starting to go off behind him just before the camera cuts. This helps make sense for the scene later in which Ant-Man is dodging pencils and pens in the middle of the fire. He is in the same office after the compound has been attacked. The same goes for the shots of the other Avengers fighting in the rubble. Speaking of those Avengers in battle, Captain America is seen gritting his teeth and strapping on his shield seemingly in the middle of a fight. Some of the fans are thinking that this shot is from the final stand of Steve Rogers and that he won't be around for much longer once it's over. 
However, if the explosion theory is true, this shot probably takes place at the beginning of the movie. Like the others, Cap is fighting off the attackers at Avengers headquarters. Then again, it's only a theory. The final scene in the trailer sees Brie Larson's Captain Marvel joining the rest of the Avengers, and Thor testing to see if she's as strong as she claims. When his Stormbreaker zooms past her head, she doesn't even flinch, and he is instantly made a fan. As we saw in the post credits scene for Captain Marvel, Carol Danvers is finally with the other Avengers, ready to take on Thanos. This scene is the first time we've seen them together in Avengers Endgame advertising, and it gave us a feel of how she will fit with the rest of them. What did you think of the new Avengers Endgame trailer? Let me know in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe and like for more great content. Let me be,